back to my channel today. I'm here and so is Tommy who is asleep right here. You can't see him but he is sprawled all over my bed taking up all the space. So I'm like, oh, and he's having a move and he's pushing me probably to get out of the way. Um, but today I wanted to do a sit down video with you guys and share some things I've bought recently. There have been a ton of sales and a certain luxury sustainable brand that I'm obsessed with went on to sale. It went 40% at reformation and I had to get some bits. I needed them. I've been watching them for a while and when they went into sale, that was it. I grabbed them. Before we get into the video, just a little reminder to subscribe to my channel, hit that bell so that you get notified. Every time I upload a video, I upload every Sunday, although this is the last video of this year. I won't be putting up any more content. I'm gonna take a holiday, time out. Well, I'm not going anywhere, I'm in the house, but I'm gonna take some time out, eat, relax, watch movies and all of that. So you'll be notified of the video in the new year. So hit that notification so you don't forget. It's Good few weeks before the new year and once you've done that we can crack on with the video I'm so dehydrated i don't know why this is my orange msm concoction for hair growth if you guys miss this head over to my natural what's it called natural ways i grow my hair i don't know i'll link it below but this is what it is okay so i have bought random pieces there is no thought behind this order. I just saw bits and I like them. There are a few winter bits and there's actually some summer bits because I was eyeing up a few tops from the summer that were just way out of my budget and was waiting for this moment and it came. <laughs> I am gonna get started with a bodysuit. So I really needed a just a casual, warm, long sleeve top. I have like baggy jumpers but I wanted something quite fitting and that I could layer up as well. So I saw, well I saw, I've been eyeing this up for a while. It's their Nisa bodysuit. So it's long sleeve, it's black. It, you can see, is a bodysuit. It's not thonged and it's, and it's also not like a full pant. So that's nice because it doesn't show through your jeans. And then it's got a button up that's quite deep, which I was really wanting. I saw a few in the usual fast fashion stores and I really didn't want to put my money there as I've been mentioning in a lot of videos and originally I think it was about 74 pounds which is a little bit steep for just you know a casual bodysuit but the quality is just amazing as always with reformation um it's made from organic cotton so it's all organic cotton it's got great stretch which is good it's very comfortable I've worn this a lot already you can see the tags already out and there's a ton of Tommy's hairs on it because his hair gets on all my black clothes but it's fine Tommy I don't mind so I popped it on with just some jogging bottoms and some trainers this is how I ha I'm wearing it at the moment because obviously there's not many places to go and I'm at home so it's super cash I've worn it with the grey ones, I would normally wear it with the black ones, but just to show you guys what it looks like without it looking like an all-in-one. I would also team this up with jeans and some heels. Um, I would, like I mentioned, layer it, so I'd wear jumpers over it. It's very warm and it's very comfortable, which is exactly what I was looking for from this bodysuit. So I bought this in a small and obviously in the black. It does come in ivory, which I did purchase. I thought that it was white. I don't know why. I didn't read it obviously, but it does say ivory on the website. I personally didn't want an ivory bodysuit. I'm looking for a white one. So I sent that back, but they are just so lovely. The ivory one's lovely as well. I bought it in the black. I got it in a size small. I paid around 50 pounds for it in the sale. So I'm super happy with that. Um, I'm gonna get so much use of it. Like I said, you can dress it up, you can dress it down. It's very comfortable and it's very warm. So I'm super happy with this one. Let me know what you guys think. Comment below, let me know, um, and I will move on to the next thing. Okay, next up is a beautiful jumper that I'm actually wearing. This jumper is just everything. I saw it, and as soon as I saw it, I was like, I'm having that. I've actually got a bra on with it at the moment, just for the video. But you can see it's tied at the back, and it's just got this beautiful button detailing here. 
I'm going to insert the clip of me actually wearing it because it's difficult for you to see right now. Um, for such a long time I've been needing a dr more dressed up jumper and this just fit the bill. The minute I saw it guys, like, I was like, you're mine. I love it. Um, and I like it as well because you can dress it down, you can put a jacket on and no one would know about the detailing on the back. But it's got these lovely balloon sleeves but they're not too exaggerated. I know some of them can be quite exaggerated. This, this one's a bit more subtler. It comes in at the cuff, you can see. Um, like I mentioned, it's got this detailing on the back at the top and then it's got the bow. I've teamed up here with some black high-waisted pencil tailored trousers, open toe shoes and just a bag. Like, this is how I would wear it. I would, this is how I'd go out to a dinner or you can even wear it with jeans. I'm wearing it with, oh, you can't see, but I'm wearing it with denim jeans right now. Um, and even trainers. This is definitely something I'm going to be wearing over the holidays. It just is perfect. Cozy, warm, but it's just got a bit of something about it. This jumper is cropped, so it does sit above the belly button. I'm wearing it with high waist trousers, so it's easily tucked in. A lot of my trousers are high waisted. Um, even the jeans I'm wearing, they're quite high waisted. If there's a gap, it's a very, very small one. So just so you guys know, it's not a full length jumper. But that's why, so that you can get that bow detailing to sit in the middle of your back. The jumper's actually really, really lightweight. It doesn't feel heavy at all, um, which is really nice, especially for a jumper that you would wear out or to an event when it's cold. You don't want it to be too heavy because sometimes you can just get hot and sweaty at things. Although there's not any events going on at the moment, but even at Christmas, it could get hot. There's a whole lot of cooking and eating. So it's very lightweight, which is another feature I loved about it. Um, and it's made from recycled cashmere. And I love cashmere, so the fact that it's all recycled is just so good. I bought this in a size small, which is true to size for me at Reformation. And it was originally £245. Honestly, it's so much for a jump up, but I know that the quality is there, it's sustainable, there's a lot of work that's gone into it, and workers and everyone's being treated fairly so for that every penny is worth it but it is a lot of money so when I saw this go into sale that I, I just I didn't care so I paid a hundred I think 150 or 170 around that mark this is definitely an investment piece for me this is a piece I could wear every winter without a shadow of a doubt I'm definitely holding on to this let me know what you guys think do you like it it does now come so when I first saw this, it only came in this colour. So it's like a, it's it's like a dark cream. It does come in black cinnamon and eucalyptus, which is like a sage green, which are all really nice. But this, I got the right colour. I'm very happy. So yeah, I love this. Let me know what you guys think. Comment below. I'm not going to ask you whether I should keep it because I'm keeping it. <laughs> I have been waiting for this for months. So yeah, let me know and I will move on to the next one. So next up, I got a strap top, but it's to me, to me, it's not just any strap top. I struggle with strap tops because of the size of my bust. I always need to wear a bra, then the straps show. Normally my bra straps are quite thick because that's what happens when you go past a D cup, the straps get thicker and it just doesn't look cute. But when I saw, well not even saw, but when I tried this on, guys, so it, it doesn't look like much me just holding up like this. So I'm gonna put it on for you. But the way that they've done it is where your boobs go, it actually holds them so you don't need a bra. And the back part is like a ruched, like a stretchy ruching, so Wherever the material needs to give around your body, it gives. So you don't get like that four boob thing where they push in because everything's so tight. And even when you move, the material is moving with you. I actually bought this in the summer in a floral print. Let me grab it. So this is the floral one, which I loved. In fact, it was when I bought this and put it on, I just thought I need this in a black so I can wear it more because this one I don't wear as much as I would a black one. So when I saw this went into sale, or did it go into sale? I don't even 
no I think it went to sale um I had to grab it so I popped it on with a pair of high-waisted jeans and some black open toe heeled sandals but to be honest you could wear this with anything really I could I had it on earlier with my black tailored trousers you could pop a blazer over that you could wear this with anything with skirts and that's exactly why I wanted to get the black so that I could use it as much as I can with lots of outfits this top comes quite short you can see it's um not so deep but everything I have is high-waisted so it fits the bill for me so I bought this in a US size 4 which is a UK 6 um which I suppose not, isn't normally my size I'd probably be an 8 to 10 but I think because it's quite fitted and you do have this material, I mean, you can see how far it stretches that you can probably size down. In fact, this one I think is even smaller. I think I bought this in a two. I did. I bought this one in a two and this fits as well. It's obviously a little bit more tighter, but it fits. So really you can, you can size down on this if you want. If not, I'm sure the eight would fit. I would definitely size down on these tops because they have give. They definitely have give and you want it to be quite fitted. And if you're, if you have a larger bust, then you want them to be secure and stay in because you wouldn't really wear a bra with this. I mean, could you wear an underwire with this? I personally wouldn't because like I mentioned, you've basically kind of got little cups and it's quite structured. So they all sit in place. Can you hear Tommy's little bell while he's cleaning? Tommy, this is not a bathroom. <laughs> this one actually wasn't in sale. Oh, I thought it was. Well, this is actually £90, which again, I know is quite steep for just a strap top. But for me, I can't buy strap tops. It's very difficult for me. So when I got this one, this one I got in a... No, in fact, this one I bought on Depop. So it's actually secondhand and I got it for like 50 quid. But once I had this, I was like, I need the black one. Um, and paying that little extra for the comfort and not having my bra hanging out when I want teeny little straps, it was worth it. But let me know what you guys think, comment below, and I will move on to the next one. Next up, we have this gorgeous, gorgeous jacket. You obviously cannot see it by me holding up because it's a lot of jacket. So I will pop in the frame of me wearing it. I've styled it up with just a white jog jogging, like loungewear set. Again, because this is kind of my vibe at the moment because I'm not going anywhere with white trainers and this is exactly why I wanted a long luxurious jacket to style up and smarten these more casual looks. I have nothing in my wardrobe like this. The colour is just such a beautiful earthy beige. It's extremely soft. It is, it is a bit heavy when I'm holding it like this but when I've got it on it's not. Um, it's very long, like originally when I showed it to Stefania, she was like, oh, it's a bit long. But when I styled it up for her, she kind of understood. I really want a longer jacket, especially when it's cold and you're not wearing a puffer to have yourself covered and no wind and get through keeps you a bit warmer. So that I actually like. It's got a tie waist, as you can see, which I tie behind, like you can see I'm doing in the video. But you can also tie it in the front and it looks great if you're wearing it with like black jeans and like the open toe heels and then you just give it a tie up maybe with a black turtleneck. It can be dressed up and dressed down. Oh, there he goes. Bye, Tommy. Are we boring you? There you go. He's off. I can actually get a bit more comfortable. But you can dress it up and dress it down, which again is just key for me when I'm um, buying pieces, because I like to wear them. I like to utilize them as much as I can. So I bought this in, I bought the jacket in an extra small, which is ideal for me. Any bigger meant it would have been a lot longer. I'm about five, six, going on to five, seven, and it's just at my ankles, 
which is enough. Um, also the size, I don't want it to look too oversized because it will just swamp me because my frame is very small. So this fits me perfectly. This jacket does come in black too, which is also gorgeous. I do have a black jacket, so I opted for this gorgeous stony brown beigey colour. So this originally was £310, which I don't think is bad for a jacket at all. I mean, you can you get these sort of jackets for around the 250 mark anyway, and the fact that it's sustainable. Um, the material is, it's actually dead stock outerwear fabric that they've used. So it's 54% polyester and 46% wool, but it's actually dead stock. So that material has not gone to waste. So I think for 310, it's actually a really, really good price, but I also got it in the sale. So I did actually get it for around the 250 pound mark, which I thought was amazing. But let me know what you guys think. Comment below, let me know what you think. I am keeping it. In fact, it. I think I'm actually keeping everything in this, but I wanna know what you guys think. So please comment below, let me know um, your thoughts because I always appreciate them. And I think, I'm on to the last piece. So I didn't buy tons, I didn't go crazy, but I just, I got what I needed basically. So this top was a top that I saw actually in the summer and I fell head over heels with this top. The only reason I didn't buy it at the time is because it was 160 and I just thought that's just a little bit too much. And especially cause it was like in the middle of the year where things, were just so uncertain. I mean, they still are uncertain, but I just didn't want to spend the money at that moment. So I've kept my eye on it and it has gone into sale. So it was originally £160 and I got it for £112. So I was super happy, got my little saving and have I even showed you the top yet? <laughs> it's this, <laughs> honestly, it's this white, sort of sweetheart neckline with puff sleeves and this gorgeous bow detailing at the back. Obviously, you can't see really what it looks like until I've put it on. So I'm gonna put it on for you so you guys can see. And I've just teamed up with my high-waisted jeans again, some heels, and it's just the perfect summer top. I mean, I would wear this with sandals mainly, like flat sandals. Um, walking around, but I just feel like this top is just the perfect summer top to just dress you up. It's made out of linen, it's 100% linen, and I love linen, and it's such a good breathable fabric for the summer, which is another reason I really loved it. Um, but this linen is actually made from flax. Flax basically uses no water and emits about a quarter of the carbon as cotton per pound of fiber, which is amazing. I bought this in a size four. Again, that's a size six. I'd probably say thinking about it that with reformation in tops, I'm a, I am a four in everything, which is a UK six, which is, isn't my normal, normal size. So it does seem that you need to size down slightly with the brand. Um, it may change with other tops, but I think it's because again, with this ruching, I've got it, it's in this top as well you can see how much it gives and then it comes back so again it's so comfortable like you don't get any like pulling when you move or sit down or rolling or <laughs> things hanging out it's just i just that's one of the things i love um about the way reformation they do it on their dress the back of their dresses as well i just think it's so clever also comes in um so it's, it looks like this, it's white, but it's got like a blue floral print. I've actually got a dress in that print. If you guys watched my vlog on the Amalfi Coast, I'm wearing it in that video, but it's also got that print and that is actually cheaper in the sale. It's, it's 48 pounds. Maybe I should have gone with the blue. No, no, I needed the white, but maybe I should get the blue. No, I don't need the blue. So the one with the blue flowers on it is actually a lot, a lot cheaper. It's £48 for 100% flax linen. I just think that's amazing. I literally can't wait to wear this. I know I have a few months, but at least I've got it and it's ready for the summer. And that is everything, guys. I hope you liked today's video. Let me know, comment below with what you think. 
I am so pleased with my picks. Like I mentioned earlier, I'm not returning any of it. These are pieces that I've been needing for a long while. I've been watching these pieces with a very beady eye for the whole year and they are gonna be classic staple pieces in my wardrobe. And if you guys wanna check them out, like I mentioned earlier, the sale is still on. It's actually gone to 50%, so that is a lot of money saved. And if you wanna see how I'm wearing these pieces and styling them up, then head over to my Instagram. It's at Honestly Alessandra and come give me a follow. Also say, hey, drop me a DM. I love to hear from you guys and get to know you because you are my online fam and I appreciate you guys so, so much. If you haven't already, subscribe to my channel so that you get notified every time I post, which will now be in the new year. So guys, have an amazing Christmas and new year. Relax, spend time with your loved ones, forget about everything that is going on out there and just stay in here, concentrate on this and just having fun and sharing love. And I will see you in the new year. Bye guys.